Ray Allen has finally dropped in NBA Live Mobile Season 6. We're going to claim him up and then do a gameplay with a full lineup of these naughty or nice players. Um, he is the only position that we need so far. It is that shooting guard position. So we're going to claim him up. You need, I think, 8 of the 83 overall of the naughty or nice players to be able to get him. We're going to claim him up. He is giving out a gold uh, shooting boost over there. So he's going to be pretty good for the team as well, which is pretty nice to see. Let's go onto my team and stick him onto the lineup. Uh, he's going to replace Booker over there. And there it is. We have a full lineup of naughty or nice players. We've We've got Damian Lillard at point guard, Ray Allen at shooting guard, LeBron James at small forward, Dennis Rodman at power forward, and Tim Duncan at center. Let's get into some gameplay. Okay, we win the tip off. Let's go with Ray Allen. Let's try and start off with a three pointer. Can he make it? Poor release on my part. Bricks that one over there. Now, the reason I'm playing in a uh, season's game is because showdown simply, it just takes ages for me to actually find a game. I don't know why that is. If you didn't see on my community tab, I played a game on showdown and Stephen Curry just went absolutely nuts. He knocked down pretty much every single shot I was taking with him, um, getting, I think, 36 six points which is just absolutely ridiculous but let's try another three with this ray allen his three point shot is really high over here but he keeps bricking these shots he's at a 96 three point shot which is just crazy perfect release this time that's going to help him knock that one down 96 three point shot is just nuts and of course he is giving out that shooting boost which is going to help quite a few of your cards especially if you're strategic and you have some extra boost over there i am finesse so he isn't going to help me out too much getting some boost from my extra coach over there so i might need to rejig things with my team try and get some extra boost here and there from getting some more finesse players let's see what his dunks are looking like he's gonna go up for the dunk and he's gonna knock that one down really nicely there pick up the rebound there with dennis rodman let's run it up the court with tim duncan and try and go all the way for the dunk he's gonna get that and of course he's gonna knock that one down the center tim duncan is pretty good he's probably gonna be replaced on my team though when i do get one of those countdown players i probably will go for that deandre ayton because he is a finesse center and of course that means that i get to match a couple more players with my boost item to hopefully get some more boosts out to the rest of the team they're gonna break that shot over there but they're gonna keep it in and Dennis Rodman is going to make that a really tough shot for them to make. Let's play it all the way up the court to Dennis Rodman. See if he can knock down this dunk over here. Just misses that one over there, but at least we get the rebound. Let's bring it back out to this Ray Allen card over here. Can he knock it down? misses that one i think it's the poor releases on my part i'm just missing the perfect release there but let's play tim duncan out on the wing area he's going to go in for the dunk and he's going to finish that one off let's play dennis rodman over here see if he can go in for the dunk he's going to finish that one off him and lebron james both have the dunk package which is really nice to see you know i've done gameplay with lebron james i did a little bit of a quick sell challenge with him and that was so much fun to do but this dennis rodman card as well as getting really good rebounding stats he has also got that dunk package which is really nice to see but let's run out of the court with tim duncan we'll play lebron james on the right hand side let's Let's go in for the layup. He's going to finish that one off really nicely there. We're up to 13 points. We have been missing quite a few shots at the very beginning with that Ray Allen card as I was not getting a perfect release there. But let's see if we can get a steal maybe to end off the quarter. They're going to break that shot over there. So the first quarter is done. We're up by six points over there, which is pretty good. So we're going to go into the next quarter and see what else these cards can do. We're going to try and do some alley-oops to each other. All right, let's play it up to Dennis Rodman over here. See if we can get the alley-oop pass to LeBron James. Is he going to finish it off? He does. That's really nice to see. Although we're going to try and do an alley-oop pass where it finishes off with a crazy dunk if we can at least by the end of this season's game but I think definitely Dennis Rodman and LeBron James could probably finish it off with a crazy dunk we nearly get the block there with LeBron James but we get the rebound with Tim Duncan let's run up the court note the ball's going to get stolen off us by Tim Hardaway Jr can we get a steal though with this Ray Allen card nearly with Damian Lillard he nearly gets that steal there let's run up the court with LeBron James we'll play Ray Allen on the right hand side here we'll go into the corner three can he knock this one down perfect release this time he's going to sink it so it's looking like if it's a perfect release it's pretty much guaranteed to go in if it was a dodgy release which i do quite often it isn't actually going to go in let's play ray allen on the left hand side here bit of a poor release though and he is going to brick it so again it is that perfect release that is going to help him make those shots although i'm not always going to get it perfect um every single time but let's see if we can get a steal we do we get a steal i think it was dame getting the steal let's play lebron james on the left hand side he's going to go in for a really weird layup there but he manages to knock that one down i thought he's going to go in for a dunk but that's a pretty nice layup to see anyway it's a bit different let's try and knock down a three pointer with damian lillard will come out for three can he knock it down poor release again on my part and then he misses that one over there but i'm surprised that they're not getting like a full green bar they're getting sort of like this little bar that one he's going to knock down even though that was a really worse release than the other one but he's still going to knock that one down let's run it up the court with this tim duncan card see if anyone's going to be in a good position for an alley-oop lebron james was in the right position there but he wasn't going to get it we'll go in with ray allen and finish off that easy layup there he's got an 80 layup which is pretty good as well we get a triple block there it's looking like i think three of them went for the ball there but let's try and end off the quarter with a step back shot with this lebron james card the grandmaster from the promo fade away can he knock it down he sinks that one. His mid-range shot again is just absolutely nuts. It's a 100 mid-range shot. 
They're going to shoot from half court and they are going to brick that shot over there. So again, we're playing really well at the moment. A little bit of dodgy releases on my part, meaning that they're going to miss a lot of threes. But it is interesting to see both Ray Allen and that Damian Lillard card. When they go in for the three, it's not a huge green bar. It is going up to that little green bar, as it were, the little green shot meter, which is a little bit annoying. I would expect with such high three point shots, it should go up to a higher one. But it is what it is. We'll play Dennis Rodman here, see if he can knock down this tough shot. He's going to break that one again. Ray Allen's going to go for the rebound and just miss that put back shot, though, which is a little bit annoying. All right, let's see if we can maybe get an alley -oop pass. Someone needs to get into a good position here if we want to try and find someone. Ray Allen's just going to dribble around a little bit. Let's try and find someone if they can go into the key here. We'll play it back out to Dennis Rodman. He will just finish off this dunk. Well, that was a crazy one handed slam if that had gone in, but he didn't make it. He's going to pick up the ball as everyone just sort of like stands around looking at it. But let's go in with Tim Duncan. The ball's going to get stolen off us. Yeah, let's run out of the court with Dennis Rodman. Can he make this dunk this time? He's going to get stopped can he finish this one off he just misses that one but at least gets a rebound misses the putback shot we're going to bring it back out to Damian Lillard see if he can knock down a three-pointer from the arc can he knock it down poor release on my part he's going to brick that one I probably should be going for these perfect releases but I just can't get them there we go if the green bar is a little bit fuller but he still misses that on a perfect release let's try a deep three from Dame he bricks that one again we keep getting the rebounds though we're going to keep pushing it out see if we can knock down another three LeBron James for three Bricks it again, even with that perfect release. What is happening? Let's try it again. Perfect release this time. Can he knock it down? That time he does manage to knock it down. So it isn't just my poor releases. Even if you get it perfect, sometimes it's not going to go. And I don't know why. Um, even with such high three-point shots on all three of them, like LeBron James, Damian Lillard, and that Ray Allen card, all have really high three-point shots, but they keep missing the shots, which isn't that good. Let's run up the court though with Tim Duncan. Going for the dunk. He's just unstoppable in the paint. Going to finish that one off with anyone around him. All right, we've got seven seconds left on the clock. Let's try and play LeBron James, the grandmaster from this promo. Let's see if he can finish this quarter off with a three-pointer. It's a two-pointer, and he's going to finish that one off just inside the arc there. Really deep, too, but he is going to finish that one off. They're going to shoot from half court, and they're going to miss again. We're heading off into that final quarter with 34 points for the team, which is pretty good considering how many shots we just missed randomly, which I don't understand. We're going to go in with this Ray Allen card, see if he can finally knock down another three. Um, maybe a try a step back shot if we can let's go in we'll find a bit of space let's go in for this sort of hot step step back shot he's gonna break that one poor release and that was pretty far out by the time he'd sort of step back over there let's try another one we'll go in for the mid-range shot can he finish this one off bricks that one again I don't know what is going on with the shooting we keep missing a ton of shots here even with the perfect releases which is really sad to see I mean I'd expect them to make quite a few of these shots but they're just not dropping for us this time let's try with LeBron James see if he can make this fade away He's going to sink that one. Let's find Ray Allen over here. See if he can go all the way for the dunk. He's going to dunk over Porzingis and just miss that one over there. I thought that was going to go in, but I guess Porzingis, he is over seven foot. So maybe that's what's stopping him from getting that dunk. He goes past Porzingis over there. Can he finish his shot off? And of course, he's going to finish that dunk off really nicely there. Going through Porzingis for the dunk. I think we need another dunk package dunk here. Let's run it up the court with LeBron James going all the way with that one-handed slam. It's so nice to see anyone with the dunk package. So we're going to try Rodman again. Damian Lillard nearly picks up the steal there. We'll play Rodman here. See if he can run it up the court. Do some dribble moves. Try and get around his man over here. Spin move. Spin move again. Can he go in for the dunk? Goes in for that windmill dunk. That was just absolutely nuts. I don't get why his dunk rating is so low considering he has got that dunk package. I don't really understand that, but it is what it is. We get the rebound with LeBron James. Let's run it up the court with Ray Allen. We'll come back out and play Tim Duncan over here. See if he can finish this shot off. He gets stopped by Porzingis. That's not going to stop him from scoring. Scoring with contact is an 88 and he's going to finish that shot off. Rodman again going all the way for the easy layup, just making it look so easy there, knocking that one down. We come up with this steal there with Ray Allen. Ray Allen's got to finish this shot off now. Three pointer, perfect release. Splashes that one really nicely. Can we get a steal though with this Damian Lillard card? We've got 15 seconds left on the clock. We do we come up with a steal. Let's go with Damian Lillard. Really tough shot. He's going to sink that one. Now we're knocking in the threes right at the end. I don't get why it's right at the end and not all throughout the game, but he's going to knock down that really tough shot. Okay, we've got 0.8 seconds to hit a shot with this Damian Lillard card. Can we do it? bricks that one over there not the best of shots he was very challenged but it was in range yeah these five players are really nice to play with two of them have the dunk package three of them have got really high three-point shots and the other two are just absolute monsters when it comes to defense and going through for the dunks which is just absolutely nice to see but yeah this is the full lineup they are all 89 except for that 91 overall lebron james of course you can try and pick up that mikhail as well he is a power forward he is strategic and he is giving out i think it's a stonewall boost or something like that a defensive boost and if you want to go check out the insane quick sell challenge I did with just this 91 overall LeBron James. Go check out this video in the bottom left hand corner and I'll see you guys in that one. Peace.